We really think that the human connection is something that we can tap into. We want our community, just like we want our people to be happy to work here, we want our community to be extremely happy to have us here. Having the ability to work with the university in, in different ways has been you know, really cool. Creature came into this community intentionally mindful of the sort of footprint it was going to have in Athens. We are here to help. We are here to be good neighbors, good corporate citizens in this community. It's our commitments to this community that make this the kind of place that folks who went to the University of Georgia want to work, that they see this as a sort of mirror reflection of that commitment that was instilled in us at UGA, that now there's a business here in town that is similarly oriented. We feel like if we can be an anchor to our town as a for-profit business that is giving back a lot, it allows us to be in a place where we are helping with our community's greatest needs. When this all started, the first thing we did was sat down and started by looking at our values and our purpose. What we figured out was that we're all very curious people. The Crave Curiosity thing is not just a uh, tagline, it's really who we are. We felt like if we kind of filter everything through that, like that's the common thread. It reflects who we are, but it also helps to inspire other people. But kind of a second piece to the curiosity is the passion. Once you find out what you're passionate about and work really hard and find happiness, then you get to enjoy the creature comforts of life. Get Comfortable is really our original and still our flagship impact program. And what it looks like today is this desire to align corporate philanthropy. We are trying to take as many resources from as many businesses that have answered this call to serve through their organization, and we're trying to focus and concentrate those resources to you know, put them in the hands of the agencies that are doing the heavy lifting in our town. We just think you should have a plan to support the city that you love. For me personally, it really started with this acknowledgement when I was working at the University of Georgia that this institution just impressed upon me. The communities around us should be better because we're here. One of the ways that Creature Comforts gives back to the community through this program is we brew a Get Comfortable beer every year. The Get Comfortable partnership this year is with Allagash Brewing Company up in Portland, Maine. And so it led to this incredible roundtable discussion that we had um, in the Studio 225 space. It was just another really cool touch point with UGA and the Wilson Center and the community to really talk about businesses as a force for good. It's funny, when we opened up, I thought, you know, we're here and just a few blocks away is a huge major research institution that's you know, one of the biggest universities in the country and also my alma mater. What are all the different ways we could work together? And so one that we've really jumped onto for about a year now has been working with Garden, which has been extremely awesome because they have a huge herb research program. We worked with Noel Fuller there. I mean, it's like having the best pantry in the world just down the street. It's like, hey, what do you have right now? That could be really good for this project we're working on. Can we have some or buy it from you? My time at UGA, I really learned how to be a scientist. So we're partnering with UGA to get interns. So it's a huge help for us, and I think they're getting really good experience as well. Our lab is so different from any academic lab that they might get experience in. Here we have microbiology, chemistry, biochemistry, thermodynamics, engineering, a lot of problem solving. So they get a really, really broad experience, which is uh, quite a lot of fun. I think it's good because it gives you an snapshot into like an industry and especially in this department where we're working with all these other departments so you kind of get a glimpse of what they're doing but also how a company that's cohesive and working together uh, operates. Our partnership with Creature Comforts is really uh, a shared intern that helps them in their goal uh, specifically of creating the best beer in the most sustainable way possible. And so they help our sustainability lead generally come up with one big project. The first one was a ton of benchmarking, so what are we using now? And then we had a few things that we could do to improve, potentially. Creature Comforts is providing real, tangible, and valuable learning experiences for our students. When a global pandemic comes out of nowhere, you start asking yourselves, how do we respond to this moment? You learn, if you 
are going to live by your values when a crisis hits you. And I believe, you know, in a, in a few different ways, we, we've really shown that. We've always been here for something more than just making beer. And we thought about hand sanitizer being something that we might run out of and that our guests would want. So we went to work and, and had some fun creating a brand called a Clean Creature. We realized we had everything in house that we needed to pivot and to take our machinery, our manpower, our receptacles, our brand, and respond. It's a little bit of an abnormal container to get hand sanitizer in, but it works. It, it's a vehicle for us to get what people need to them. And we've been able to donate it to all the nonprofits who have asked, so we've been able to, to fill all the requests that have come through. Over a thousand bottles we've now given away to 37 different partners. The All Together collaboration was a pretty cool story. It all started with Other Half Brewing, and they put out a global call for a worldwide beer collaboration, and all proceeds from this beer would go to benefit service industry workers in local communities. We wanted to highlight, you know, pay tribute to those folks that have supported us tremendously over the years and do something for them at a time when they're experiencing a lot of pain. Right at the end of March was when we announced officially this is how Get Comfortable is pivoting to respond to COVID-19. We ultimately raised just over $135,000 and we are ready to now take those funds and, and send them out. Something that is always sort of top of mind for me is what's the legacy of Creature during COVID-19. And we hope that it was that they leaned into their values, they got involved with the community. I think not only did we see our values come to life, but we really leaned into them. You know, we really used them as, as a guidepost for, for how we move forward and how we respond in, uh, in what is a really uh, you know, unusual time. I have a very unique relationship with this community. I've been a child in, in Athens, Georgia. I've been an undergrad, I've been a grad student. During each of those chapters of life, I would say it was far more my time here as a graduate student that really fortified the direction that I've been moving in for the last 10, 11 years. The University of Georgia has definitely given me way more than I could ever give it in return. I've really been instilled with the value of giving back and I knew I wanted to make a difference and I wanted to make my community a better place. In addition to that commitment to service that UGA instills, one of the things you learn is that team is important. And so the opportunity to now step on to a team comprised of as many Bulldogs as there are here, really there's like no limit to what we can accomplish as a company and on behalf of this community. Athens holds a special place in my heart. Being an undergrad here at UGA, I just love the feel of the city and we've sort of built our lives here and we've built the company here, so hope to be here for a long time. Today I showed Professor Burley's class around here. I took Intro to Horticulture from him 20 years ago and it's just really cool to kind of be on the other side of the, the coin and be able to, to all work together because at the end of it it's like, oh yeah, we're all, we're all trying to make our home the best it can be and we're all trying to do something cool and we're all just like it here and it's, it's all right. We hoped one day somebody would say that they are just so glad that we're here. That if you were to subtract Creature from this community, you'd be losing something substantial. We just want Athens to be better because we're here.